a skin cell membrane issue, and that means you want to focus on fats and fatty vitamins and fat absorption. And considering that fat malabsorption syndrome is such a significant problem, you can see why so many people have skin health issues. But we'll continue talking about that tomorrow as we move on talking about cysteine and amino acids and proteins and, and all the different ways that amino acids and, and cells and cell membranes can affect health. Uh, and on things you can do about it as well. Tomorrow we'll tell you about some of the things that you can do if you're dealing with acne or you're dealing with miliary keratosis or any skin disease. We'll talk about how you can stabilize and strengthen and help repair that cell membrane using foods, using nutrition, using nutritional supplements, and using dietary and di digestive and lifestyle strategies. Okay, we've got a full board. When you hear somebody drop off, if you want to uh, give us a shout, it's 855-660-4261. We'll try to get to all our callers today. So if you're, uh, if you're on hold, hang tight. We'll see if we can squeeze everybody in. Tara in North Carolina, you're first up. Welcome to the Bright Side. What's up? Hi. Um, I called about the Highland Baby Colic Tablets, but actually what you're talking about right now about the cell disease, my daughter was born with a skin disease. She okay. came out of the womb okay. with, and what the dermatologist thinks it is, is Ilvin. Is what? And Say that again, ma'am. Sylvan? Ilvin. I don't know what that is. Uh, inflammatory linear virosis oh. epidermal needle. Dude, yeah. Man, that makes yeah. me so angry. Okay, let's He's break that apart. Old. I never even heard it. Hang on. I want to break that apart for you. Inflammatory. I never heard of that acronym. Inflammatory lymphatic, did you say? Inflammatory linear. Linear. Okay. Virosis. Oh, God. Neurosis. Okay. It starts with the V. Virosis. Oh, virosis, okay. Yeah, epidermal nevus. They should be ashamed of themselves, those idiot dermatologists. Idiot dermatologists. Yeah, she's been going in circles since she was born. And I, uh, my friend told me about Dr. Wallach, and so I've been going that direction, trying to so, look for answers. And okay, I want, you to, I, I want you to go over that again. Inflammatory linear virosis epidermal nevus, right? Is that what you said? Yes. Yes. Those dumb, dumb asses. Excuse me, I'm sorry, I shouldn't say that. <laughs> dumb donkeys. You know, here's the deal. It's an inflammatory disease of the skin. It has nothing to do with any of those stupid words. By the way, inflammatory linear vercosis epidermal nevus. Now, now, what do you think happens when somebody who doesn't know medicine or doesn't know health hears that? It freaks you out. It totally yeah. freaks you out. And if you tell, if the dermat, go to the dermatologist and you, or the dermatologist tells you you have Ilvin, they'll also tell you there's no cure for it, right? Did they tell you that yes. part? Yes. Right? And because they're boneheads. You know, yeah. medicine in general, aside from heroic medicine, surgical medicine, you know, and, and that is very helpful, obviously. If you get hit by a car, you have a heart attack, or you need some surgery, obviously you need a surgeon. But ambulatory medicine is absolutely, it's so stupid when it comes to health. That's why it's such a failure. But the dumbest of the dumb is dermatology, all right? Because the only thing they can give you is, is, is anti-inflammatories and immune suppressants. Here's the bottom line. Yeah. When you have an inflammatory condition of the skin, by definition, Literally, you have an immune problem. This is how inflammation shows up. The immune system, the body's defensive system, is somehow protecting itself, and the inflammatory process, believe it or not, is a, is a manifestation of the protective response. Here's what you do. And, and you can tell that it's immune problem, an immune problem, by the way, because what kind of drugs do they give you for inflammatory linear vercosis epidermal nevus or anything else? What do they give you? They give you an immune suppressant. Because obviously, bonehead dermatologists, obviously, it's an immune problem. I'm sorry that I'm getting all upset here. I'm going to calm down and take a deep breath. Your baby, your baby has a problem with her immune system. Now, this could be due to an allergic reaction, something that she's not processing correctly, or it can also be a problem uh, w with uh, defective skin cell shapes. Uh, that's, we're we're going to talk about this tomorrow. When the shape of a, of a skin cell becomes defective, it becomes an enemy to the body, and the body's immune system will be activated. Think about it. You have cells. They're supposed to have a certain shape. But if the shape is incorrect due to starvation, suffocation, and toxification, that cell then, then becomes interpreted by the defensive system as an enemy, and that triggers the immune response. So here's what you need to do. Step number one, all right? You've got to figure out what's getting in your breast milk that is uh, – or what's in the breast milk that is – if there is anything in the breast milk that's – I assume you're breastfeeding, correct? 
Yes, I am. Okay, so something's in the, possibly, possibly, this isn't 100%, but it's a possibility, something's in the breast milk that's activating the baby's immune system. Do you have food allergies or food intolerances or digestive issues? Um, I no, I'm don't. about it. Yes, no. I don't know. Okay. Well, that's a good question. That's a, that's a fair answer. you got to find out, though. you got to find that out. That's very important. Because if you're passing, it, passing uh, allergens through your breast milk, your baby's going to react to that. So you got to find out if you have any problems with dairy, with grains, with, with legumes, beans, soy, uh, anything, really. It could be anything. But dairy and grains are the number, uh, number one and number two uh, problems. But it could be anything. you got to find that out. Because as soon as you eliminate your food out, the food allergens that are getting your milk, if there are any, chances are your baby's skin condition is going to improve right off the right from the get-go and if you had digestive problems while the baby was in the womb that could have caused the problem in the womb and at birth so I'm guessing number one that you got some kind of digestive issues and you're passing those problems through those uh, the toxins and allergens through your breast milk that's number one number two okay. get your baby or, or through your breast milk you should be on a good probiotic supplement get on the, um, the biolumin nightly essence take three in the morning and three at night and then also eat lots of fermented food Kefir, miso, tempeh, um, uh, kimchi, uh, sauerkraut. Anything that's fermented is going to be in your interest, and that will help the, support the baby's health. Was the baby born vaginally or cesarean? Vaginally. Okay, so you're, so chances are the baby got her, got his or her uh, coating of bacteria. Focus on digestive health and wellness. That's first and foremost. Tomorrow we're going to talk about the, the relationship of fats and fatty vitamins to skin health. Uh, so you're going to want to make sure that you're getting your fatty vitamins too. Uh, hang tight because there's a couple more things I want to tell you about how you can tell if you're dealing with fat malabsorption problems, um, Tara. So don't go away. And then if you're on hold, hang tight. We'll get to all our callers when we come back from our break. I'm Pharmacist Ben. You're listening to The Bright Side on the Genesis Communication Network. And we'll be back right after this. Many Americans suffer from digestive problems, often totally unaware they're not absorbing essential nutrients from foods and supplements. Dr. Peter Glidden is aware of the importance of healing a damaged digestive system. Now, the product that I'm going to talk about today, Mackey Plus, and it is a combination of a superfruit, the Mackey Berry, and aloe vera juice. Now, aloe vera is a very interesting nutritional supplement to talk about because aloe vera, you know, it's the stuff that you put on your skin if you get a burn. And, man, it really knocks down the pain, the inflammation of the burn and facilitates healing. Well, guess what? It does the same thing internally that it does externally to burns. To soothe and heal your digestive system, order Mackey Plus today by calling 855-347-3696. That's 855-347-3696 or on the web at fireyourmdnow.com. That's FireYourMDNow.com. So we decided to upgrade the look of our home. You know, improve the curb appeal. We decided to add the look of stone to the exterior. We really like the stacked stone look. Yeah, but when I checked into the price, it was ridiculous. No way could we afford it. Then a friend told me about Genstone. G-E-N-S-T-O-N-E. Genstone comes in lightweight panels made of polyurethane. They've actually engineered the hassle out of installation. No mortar, no mesh. It was easy. Even I could do it. We just screwed the panels to the wall and it looks like stone. I mean, it really looks like stone. Yeah, from the box to the wall in minutes. We love the look of our home now. And Genstone is durable, comes with a 25-year warranty, and offers additional R-value for insulation. If you want the look of stone at a price you can afford, call Genstone at 855-955-STONE. Trust me, you'll save money. And you'll love the look. 855-955-STONE. That's 855-955-STONE. 7866. I will never forget the day my son Jeremy told me he hated me and slammed the door in my face. I'm behavioral therapist Janet Lehman. Behavior problems can turn the child you love and your life into a nightmare. That's why my husband James and I created the Total Transformation, the step-by-step program that shows you how to fix the worst behavior problems and get your child to respect and listen to you again. No matter what the behavior, defiance, backtalk, angry outbursts, disrespect, we can help you stop it. Now you can get the Total Transformation for free. All you need to do is get the program and let us know how it works for you. You can keep it forever for free. 
Limited number of free programs available. Call now. 1-888-912-1595. 1-888-912-1595. That's 1-888-912-1595. 1-888-912-1595. We all know that Berkey Water Purification Systems are the most trusted name in water filtration. As an authorized Berkey dealer for over six years and serving thousands of satisfied customers, the Berkey Guy offers amazing specials for Berkey water filtration systems. The Berkey Light Systems include a set of self-sterilizing and recleanable black purification elements that purify water by removing chlorine, pathogenic bacteria, cysts and parasites to non-detectable levels and remove harmful chemicals such as herbicides and pesticides. Order the Berkey Light System today complete with two black Berkey elements for only $231 and the Berkey Guy will ship your order free of charge. With the purchase of a Berkey Light, the Berkey Guy is also offering a set of fluoride and arsenic filters for only $39.99. That's over 30% off the retail price. Call the Berkey Guy at 1-877-886-3653. That's 1-877-886-3653. Or order online at GoBerkey.com. That's GoBerkey.com today. We are America's largest independently owned communications network, GCN. All right, we're back on the bright side. Tara in North Carolina. You there, ma'am? Yes, I am. Okay, so as far as your baby goes with the inflammatory linear varicose epidermal nevus, which are basically uh, overgrowth of skin cells, as we've, mm-hmm. we've been talking about, just kind of like a psoriasis type of disorder. The, uh, the main treatment is immune suppressant steroids. Topical steroids is what they typically will give you. Uh, sometimes they'll give you moisturizers. They give you what, what kind of steroid? They give you a Lidex cream or beta-methasone or something like that, right, for the baby. As if they, um, the, Yeah, they give us urea cream, and I did not like it. Okay. Well, urea is not as bad as a steroid cream, but in general, the treatment is a top. Uh, urea is designed to scrape off. It's a, a special uh, medicine that scrapes off that surface, those cells that are growing too fast. If cells grow too fast, you probably got yourself some kind of immune condition, immune cell condition, immune condition that's affecting the skin cells, causing them to become misshapen and causing, uh, causing them to grow too fast, etc. So here's what you need to do. Number one, you want to focus on uh, uh, food allergies and something that's getting into, uh, into your milk. If the baby's breastfeeding, that means it's you, you're the culprit here because it's something that it's getting into your milk. So focus on your own food intolerances or food allergies. If you don't know you have them, look for them. Secondly, start focusing on digestive health for yourself. That's the probiotics and the fermented foods. The Biolumin Nightly Essence for Longevity is the best probiotic supplement that you could find. The best one I've seen because not only does it have a full spectrum of probiotics in generous amounts, but it also has digestive enzymes in there as well that can help support digestion. So get on the Biolumin Nightly Essence, 3 in the morning, 3 at night. You should probably get on the Z... It's called Biolumin, that's the company, and the product is called Nightly Essence. You can find it off uh, my website, brightsideben.com, or you can call 866-735-2470. They can tell you about it. You might also want to start using the Z-Radical product, which is also very effective for digestive health. And then secondly, and we'll talk about this a little bit more tomorrow, uh, the, uh, when you have a skin disease, you have a skin cell disease. When you have a skin cell disease, you've got a skin, skin cell membrane disease. The skin cell membrane is mostly composed of fats. So you want to start focusing on fat malabsorption problems. Use fatty vitamins. Vitamin A, you should be on 20,000 international units of that a day. Uh, You want to be on 400 IU a day of vitamin E. Make sure you're getting some sun. It wouldn't hurt you to get your baby out into into the sun as well. And then also make sure you're on the ultimate essential fatty acids, ultimate EFAs from longevity. If you find that you're gassy or bloating or you have bowel movement problems or heartburn after you take your fatty vitamins or your essential fatty acids, treat that as a sign that you're not processing processing fats correctly, make sure you're using the digestive enzymes with all your meals, ultimate enzymes. It probably would be a good idea for you to get on a little extra pancreatin. This is true for all fat malabsorption problems, P-A-N-C-R-E-A-T-I-N, pancreatin. That can help you with fat malabsorption. Also, take that with your, take the pancreatin and the ultimate enzymes with your fatty nutrients and your EFAs. And also with all your meals, finish off all your meals with apple cider vinegar. I am, I'm going to go out on a limb here, Tara, and say that if you do everything I just told you, you should notice some pretty significant improvement in your baby's skin health. And I'd love it if you could stay in touch with me either via email ben at ksco.com 
or via the phone on the bright side and let us know how you're doing because you may be a work in progress and we can fine tune it. Don't let anybody tell you, don't let any dermatologist tell you that your baby has, is going to be suffering for the rest of his, life, his or her life and there's no curative treatment, etc. And don't fall for the stupidity of diagnoses, the utter nonsense of inflammation. 